Through the ice cap floods of 2054, our nation has struggled to stay afloat. Now in the year of 2576, we no longer have to. The Aquatic Submersible System, also known as the ASS, will be having its grand opening next week. As a species, we will be able to traverse the underwater lands of the Homo aquaticus, who are, as you know, fellow humans who have adapted to live peacefully underwater. Tune in next Wednesday for a special segment on the ASS featuring our lovely travel guide, TJ Journeys. Welcome to the Aquatic Submersible System. Please sit back, relax, and enjoy the beautiful ocean sights. We will be arriving at the Whale Feeding Ground Station shortly. Thank you for writing the ASS. Today, I'm Quasi. You're TJ, I presume. So you're my Homo Aquaticus guide. Yep. I'll be giving you the rundown of this place. So how's your journey been so far? Pretty cool. That's it? You're a reporter. Aren't you supposed to be descriptive? Okay, fair. Let's try that again. How's the adventure been so far? It's been insane. I can't believe you guys get to live down here. I mean, the whales and the coral and all the fish and so many colors and the light from above. Hot damn, this place is amazing. But that's more like it. The people above are so excited to see all the stuff you have down here. Well, I can't blame them. Oh, look out the window. We're coming up on the old soggy seaweed. <laughs> that was my nickname in high school. You Adverses are a wild crew. Hey, speaking of crews, legend has it that the crew of the soggy seaweed mutiny their captain and tied his body to the ship's mast, cursing him to be torn apart by hungry sharks. If you listen closely, you can still hear his ghostly gaggles. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> what was that? I'm sure it was just another whale. Right. Is that what I think it is? That's a hammerhead shark. But, um... Don't worry. We're completely safe inside the ASS. Are you sure? Absolutely. Phew. That was a close one. What? Come on, TJ, sit down, please. You're completely safe inside the ASS. Are you sure? You seemed pretty freaked out back there. There was a shark! Who would it be? Um. This metro was specifically designed to withstand high pressure and underwater creatures that come across it. Really, there's no need to be nervous. If you 
say so. At least I'm getting paid for this. I think you're really gonna like this next stop. They give you air breathers a nice insight to what life is like down under. We will be arriving at Kelpview Station shortly. Please stay in your seats and enjoy the ride. We're known for farming kelp down here. It's full of antioxidants, which help fight off disease and boost immune systems. We don't get a lot of sunlight down here, so the extra vitamins are helpful. No kidding. It's crazy how you even survived this far down. Oh, the country suburbs are so refreshing. You guys live like this? Surprised, are you? More like weirded out. to how things are done around here. Sure. We'll be arriving in the Metro Aquatica soon. You're gonna love it. Like the Big Apple, as you guys would say. Is it really that massive? I've heard it's as big as Texas. Well, before it got flooded by the Gulf. What's Texas? We will be arriving at the final stop, Metro Aquatica Station. Thank you for riding the ASS. Have a good day and don't drown. What?